Hello YouTube! Uh, today we're going to be playing a game called Craven Manor. It's a scary game. Basically, yeah, it's a horror game. And you've probably seen someone play it before. Some YouTubers. I played a little bit of it, but didn't get too far. Ooh, can I? No. Uh, basically... You're in a big, like, mansion-y thing, and this stalks you around, and you know, uh, you've got a flashlight. But for some reason, whilst it's just on the pedestal thing, before you actually start the game, if you look away and look back, it'll actually look at you. Now, if I was in this mansion and I saw that happen to me, I would leave. I would not continue. But there's some, like... Marker thing going this way, so let's begin. There are some interactive things, but it involves reading, and ain't nobody got time for that, so let's go. It's um, a nice. It's a nice ambience. <laughs> Take this with me. a little bit more. Um, yeah, basically you go go around this mansion. I have no idea why. Um, Depraved. Yeah, I can't remember what to pronounce that. So you basically collect these little models of level bits, bits from the level, and uh, you take. Piece, piece of paper flying over. You take them to here. I'm okay. The thingy is gone. So you take them here and then you go. And basically, you can move. Oh, damn it, didn't need to press that. Wrong button. You can take these and connect them. So, if I connect it here, that was where I just went into the library. If I connect it, oh, if I connect it like that, this room is now something else. See? It's now a scary room. Shall I read this? Hmm? A notice to all Craven Manor employees. Thieves and la 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 layabouts shall be disciplined by Lord Craven and shall receive no wages during that word. I'm not one for reading. Within these construction expenses. No, God, no, can't wrong. Blueprints. Blueprints design. Blueprint design is attributed to William Craven. The architecture reflects both scrupulous detail and extremely strange structural components. Cool story. If only it actually had some form of purpose throughout the game. Yeah, but this really doesn't have any form of point, to be honest. Oh god! Yeah, I don't remember that. Uh, yeah, I'm not really that scared of horror games that don't scare me that much. So. You know, if you're expecting big, over-the-top reactions, then don't. Hello. It's not very nice. I I shan't get out. I refuse. I can't remember what to do here. There's like a lever somewhere I can remember. Oh yeah, it's not really that difficult when it gets closer to you. <laughs> you can actually look at it from the corner of your screen. It, the flashlight doesn't actually have to be touching it. But the flashlight does go out, like that. 
That wasn't there before. So the wild end, right? I'm sure that's just a model from Skyrim that just ripped. I have it in low graphics because my computer can't handle it. I don't think I haven't tried. So now I'm flying here. If I put this here, which I'm not gonna because that's on the high level. Oh, that one is as well. Not bothering with that. I'm just gonna put this to one side and make it easier for myself. No, I don't want to put it there. No. I'm just making it easy for myself and just putting everything in that door because I'm creative like that. Someone's been spilling wine everywhere. Hello. Bye. with the sort of uh, Uncharted 2 style chanting-y sound effects you get. It's going all over the place. I'm just describing the visible decrease of something. Right, okay. Ooh, what's this? The wire globe feels almost like it has a slight electric charge. Well, don't prep touch it. Little baby ones. Oh. Pile of dark blurry photos. Just it's, it's something. I, no, not reading it. Pause it if you want to read it. Oh. Uh. Hmm. Label George Craven. This black and white photo with these somethings. I'm about to read it. So I'll, I'll stop reading them now, actually. That's a good idea. You can read them. There you go. Read that one if you want. Pause it. I don't care. Oop, oh, that. What was what you doing? What what? What's that book? Can I do anything with it? What do I press to open my inventory? If I can, which I probably can't. I got some options. There is nothing. Contr controls. Toggle journal. Okay, that's what I'm looking for. Ah. I stumbled upon another scale room model. This one appears to be a bedroom. The horror lives in the recesses of darkness. A place between curiosity and madness. I can feel it. It seeks to destroy me. Cool story, brah. Walking into a room. Okay. Oh, look. Delicious. What's his name? The library model appears to have two entrances. One goes to the top floor. Ah. Let's go to the top floor then. To the top floor? Okay, I'll have to put that there. Just for now. Oh god, I keep pressing E to rotate. I don't know why. That's because I'm using the creation kit. Okay, that can go there. And you can go there, and you can go there, because... Why not? Ooh, puzzle. I'm guessing that one will just get sent back, because they're tricky like that. Oh yeah. I am magic for that.
one. That's so scary. Two. when he makes that sound. Okay, so that button is not done, so... Whoa. Okay, okay. Yeah, we need to stop. stop. We should stop. Head moves. Body parts move. Let's take this magical device. <laughs> now what? I think I'm gonna end this episode. Ooh. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna end it here. This episode, and I'll continue. Finding whatever not remotely scary things. Oh, look at that, it doesn't even have a light map. Amazing. I find. Oh, I didn't know that was broken before. Yeah, anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Goodbye.